it's always fixed we have this uh, Yamaha sound system modern number is a uh, HJR5840 the problem in this one so I already plug it to the power turns on goes off try again goes off So the first thing I'm going to check in this uh, receiver, these regulators here. So we're going to check this uh, voltage in this regulator. As you see here is a 12 volt. And plus 12 volt, minus 12 volt, plus 5. This one here is a 3.3. .3. And this is minus, uh, yep, this is minus 5 volt. So let's... Uh, I'm going to work just with one hand and just be really extremely careful so you don't uh, touch uh, the regulator to short you to the ground so just watch both of them watch the multimeter and so from here and at the same time I'm going to power it on quick let's go off it's not going to work So I'm going to put one hand on the power uh, button because we're going to need to check when the when it's on. So you can see that's 112 is good. Twenty. That's the input and the output is minus 12 this is supposed to be 5 volt One point seven, five volt then go down I did say 5 volt, then it's dropped. Here 5, then go down. So 3.3 .3 is good. Minus 5 volt is here. Uh, this one. Let me see. Yeah, let's go down, up, then down. I'm gonna use this one because it's gonna show us the this is moving quicker than the digital uh, multimeter. You can see it going up and down more clearly than the digital. So I'm gonna push the power button. Not unclear. clear. 
so this is what I did uh, so far and I measure the resistance to the ground of this capacitor the small capacitors all of them on this board to see if any one is gonna give me like a low uh, ohm like something under 100 ohm that's mean the capacitor is bad uh, that's a common problem for receivers too I couldn't uh, all of them is a give me a good reading so I back to the to the regulator of the 5 volt the one in the middle over there so that regulator is like I show you before let's try it again Yeah, beside it's give the five volt at the first is near, like it's give one uh, one point something volt. So, and the receiver is go off before the regulator uh, start giving five volt. So here, let me put. Uh, and so. When you are measuring, be careful, so don't short nothing. You see 1.7. And this keep going up and down. Let's try again. You hear the first click, then the second click. Here is the first, and here is the second. After the, the receiver goes off, the five volt rise. But that's too late because the receiver is already off. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to feed, feed 5 volt to this regulator. I'm going to give the regulator 5 volt. The one uh, is here. And the first pin from from this side so. here I turn it on I don't hear the second click So let me try again because this is so I'm going to fit the voltage to there and watch the screen so. So that's what normal I do, but if I put some, uh, I'm going to give it a 5 volt to here. So I'm going to push the power button now. The receiver is stay on. So here is the receiver is on and we hear the second click for the speakers and this the receiver stay on so let me turn off the 5 volt so the problem is uh, in this receiver is the 5 volt regulator that's what is bad on it the the part number of that regulator is 7805A So let's uh, 
try to change that regulator and see if that's going to fix the problem. So this is the regulator, like you see the number is a 7805A, so here I put uh, another regulator, is match exactly 7805A, so I find another regulator for the 5 volt, this one here. And let me show you. And here it stay on. So now the regulator uh, 5 voltage work perfectly. So that's how you fix this uh, <coughs> receiver. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe and see you next video. See you next video. Now we're going to test this. It works! Yeah, it works. Yep, the problem was the 5 volt uh, regulator. And I hope this video is going to help you to fix your uh, receiver and give you an idea how uh, to check the electronics. And see you on the next one.